Hi everyone, in this tutorial I want to show you how you can perform some secondary color correction using the qualifiers in DaVinci Resolve 9. So to get us started I've already created a project in DaVinci Resolve 9 where I've brought in a single clip and then I've applied my primary color correction to that clip using the first node in the node editor. However, after performing my primary color correction I noticed that the mugs here in my shot are not as present as I would like them to be. And so to correct for that, I'm going to use the qualifier, which will allow me to isolate the color of the mugs and then perform a secondary adjustment on the color to give it the look that I want for this shot. So the first thing that I need to do is add in a serial node. And once I've added this second node, I'm going to go down and click on the qualifiers button in the toolbar. And that's going to bring up my HSL qualifier. And basically what the qualifier allows you to do is pull a chroma key for a specific area of the image so that you can make adjustments just in that area. So you'll notice as I go over my image I have an eyedropper and what I want to do with this eyedropper is select the color that I want to isolate. And if I click and drag I can select the yellow and in this process it's easier if you can see what you're doing. So over here if I select my highlight button I can see the area of the image that I've selected. Now once I've sort of given it a general range to be looking at, I can use my hue, saturation, and luminance controls to adjust the area of the image that I'm isolating. So I'm just going to do that. I'm going to blur out my selection a little bit. And you can see that by using the hue, saturation, and luma controls, I've gotten a pretty good isolation of my mugs here on the table. However, you will notice that I have gotten some area up here in the top of my image that I don't want, and also over here in the side. And to sort of correct for that, I can just use a power window. And by putting a power window in here, you'll see that sort of masks out the area of the image that I'm trying to isolate. And that looks pretty good. And now if I go back into my qualifier and turn off my highlight, I'm ready to adjust the mugs to make them a little bit more present in my image. And to do that, I'm just going to adjust my saturation by bringing up the yellow. And you'll see right away that sort of helps them to be a bit more present. And then I can also adjust the tone of just the yellow and the mugs to put them a bit more in line with what I'm going for in this shot. And if we look at a quick before and after. And as you can see, by using the qualifier to isolate one area of our image and then bringing up the saturation only in that part of our shot, we've really been able to make these cups stand out from the rest of our shot. And so that's a quick overview of how you can use the qualifier in DaVinci Resolve 9 to perform a secondary color adjustment by isolating a specific area. So I hope that this tutorial has been helpful for you. And thanks for watching.